Hey, do you mind if we make a quick stop at the Pokemon Center before my battle? Sure. My Pokemon could use some rest. It should be right around here. Look! Hi. How do you like our little problem? What happened? We think the boulder rolled down the mountain during the night. Now it's blocking the path to the Pokemon Center and we're trying to figure out how to move it. Hey! I bet Blaziken or Sceptile here can help. They can blast it apart, right? Go Sceptile! Blaziken! Let's get out of the way and let them work. Blaziken, you Sky Uppercut! Blaziken! Hmm, maybe this is more Sceptile's kind of thing. Let's go Sceptile! I guess I'll have to be the one. Don't worry, Officer Jenny. I've got it under control. On the other hand, maybe we should check with Ciara. She might have some ideas about how to move it. Hey there. Whoa, that's one big rock. It sure is. And it's blocking the way to the Pokemon Center. We're trying to come up with some ideas on how to move it. I mean, look at it. That boulder's huge. If only there was some way we could put it on something and, and maybe roll it away. But we don't have massive equipment like that around here. You know, there are things you can use to help make your job easier that don't have to be massive and are actually quite simple. They can have only one or two moving parts or no moving parts at all. Like for rolling the boulder away, you could use a wheel and axle. Wheel makes sense. But what's the axle part? The axle is a shaft that attaches the wheel to the object you want to move. Like on a wagon, right? The wagon isn't directly on the wheel. The wagon rests on the axle. Exactly. If the wagon was on the wheel, there'd be a lot of friction. That would wear it on the wheel. Okay, so that's it. We'll put the boulder on a set of wheels and axles and roll it away. But we need to get the boulder onto the axle. How can we lift something that's so heavy? How about a pulley? A pulley makes lifting or moving easier by adding a wheel to a rope. If you just pull something with a rope, you have to work awfully hard. But if you wrap the rope around the wheel, the turning wheel does some of the work for you. That's awesome. So we need a pulley and wheels and axles and... We're going to have to attach a rope to the boulder somehow. A screw can help you attach things. A screw is actually an inclined plane wrapped around a shaft. An inclined plane is used to help move things. It's easier to carry or push something up an inclined plane, like a ramp or a ladder, than it is to try to climb a straight vertical surface. Now, once you have your screw made by wrapping the plane around the shaft, you can use it to hold something together. You can turn the screw, and by turning it, you can move the object. Sounds like we're set! Let's go to town and look at a store to see what we can find and test them out. Let's see what we have in here. Okay. Look at the fan. Click on the simple machine at the bottom of the screen that helps make the fan work. Great job! A screw holds the blades of the fan together. It helps the blades turn. Look at the crane. Click on the simple machine at the bottom of the screen that helps the crane work. That's it! The pulley uses a wheel to help the rope pull objects. Look at the wagon. Click on the simple machine at the bottom of the screen that helps the wagon work. Awesome! The bed of the wagon rests on the wheel and axle. The axle helps keep friction from wearing down the wheel. Look at the bicycle. Click on the simple machine at the bottom of the screen that helps the bicycle work. Right! You can ride a bicycle because of the wheel and axle. The wheel turns around the axle when you pedal. Look at the blinds. Click on the simple machine at the bottom of the screen that helps the blinds work.
Fantastic! The pulley helps raise and lower the blinds. Look at the light bulb. Click on the simple machine that helps that work. Absolutely! The threading on the light bulb helps fasten it into place in the socket. That was great work! Now let's look at this boulder and see what we can do to move it. Here's the boulder. Now let's try some different ways to move it. Click on the simple machine you would use to get the boulder off the ground. Way to go! What action does the pulley take to get the boulder off the ground? Click push, pull, roll, or lift the boulder. You got it! Click on the simple machine you would use to roll the boulder out of the path. Yep. Click on the simple machine that helps that work. Yep. Yep. Click on the simple machine you would use to add a little more power to help the rope pull objects. That's it! What action does the pulley take to get the boulder out of the path? Click push, pull, roll, or lift the boulder. Yep. Hooray! There you are. We've been trying to get rid of that boulder, but it was so huge. Now we can open the Pokemon Center again. However did you do it? Oh, it was no problem. It was actually really simple. Machines? <laughs> Think of a tool that would help hold the blades together and let them turn. Try again. Think of a tool that would help hold the blades together and let them turn. Try again. Here's what we're looking for. A screw holds the blades of the fan together. It helps the blades turn. Look at how the wheel at the top of the crane turns and helps pull things up. Try again. Look at what the bed of the wagon rests on. It helps the wagon roll. Try again. Think about what happens when you pedal. What turns? Try again. Think about how blinds are raised and lowered. What would help that happen? Try again. What do you do to put the light bulb into place? What holds it there? Try again. Try again. Try again. Here's what we're looking for.
What action does the pulley take to get the boulder off the ground? Click push, pull, roll, or lift the boulder. Click on the simple machine you would use to roll the boulder out of the path. Click on the simple machine that helps that work. Click on the simple machine you would use to add a little more power to help the rope pull objects.